We all fine, it's funny. You know, people always want to talk about other people's kids, other people's families, right? I'll let you do that to them. So somebody that mentions talking about their kids or some shit. They ready to fight. They ready for this and that, right? They'll try and put people in lockup. But yet, they want to talk about other people's kids. Because the funny thing is, my family don't do anything. They don't do the Alabama shit. But like I said, let somebody do it to them. Let somebody start talking about their family, their kids. They go around calling their kids retarded. Calling their kids anything like that. They're ready for fight. They're ready for all this and that. Or they're trying to get people locked up. But they can do it to other people. But this is a prime example. Things I said before, people are more worried about my life and my family than worry about their own. Because be real, what is in the bad business if my family was related? Or my family was doing incest, some shit like that. Because that wouldn't be nobody's business, right? That's, that's our business. Background, our business. But prime example of what I said before, people are not gonna keep their nose in the face. People will do anything for, for, um, as, uh, for drama. They'll do anything for a reaction. And they will do anything to try and stir up more shit just so they can pretend that they don't stir up shit, that none of this, because what does anybody's family got to do with anybody? Like, that ain't nobody's business, but guess what? People still worry about that. People still more worried about somebody else's life or somebody else's shit than worry about their own goddamn business. That's how it's always going to be. Because you know what? I ain't never talked about nobody's kids, nobody's family, none of that. But you hear motherfuckers always talking about my family, my kids, or something to do with me. Like, yeah, I don't know. What's in here? Can't go in there. Yeah, they shut that all down. People used to be fucking in there and shit. <laughs> but, like I said, prime exam, people can't keep it nose in the face. And people always more worried about me and try to do anything they can to get a rise out of me and try to start shit. But the funny thing is, I don't let that shit get to me no more. People talking shit on my kids, people talking shit on my family. Because you know what? That just shows jealousy. That just shows right there that I am doing, I'm doing everything right. That I have haters. Because you know what? If I wasn't doing nothing right and I wasn't living my life right, they wouldn't be hating. They wouldn't be talking shit. They wouldn't be worrying about none of that. So obviously, I'm doing what I'm doing the right thing. Everything I'm doing is right. And apparently, I'm a motherfucking winner because all they do is talk shit and run their mouth off about me when everything they say is all lies and just bullshit. And you know what? I don't let that shit get to me. I fucking laugh at shit like that. And I keep a smile on my motherfucking face and I keep enjoying my motherfucking time because while motherfuckers talk shit and hate, I'm just living my life and doing right. And they mad about how much fun me and my family have and I'm loving that. I'm loving that. Because haters will be haters. Punk bitches will be punk bitches. Taking a shit, sucking a dick, that's all they do. Suck on my dick while they take a shit. <laughs> Boy, I love it. Man, y'all yeah, have a great motherfucking day. Because you know what? I'm loving my motherfucking life. Because why they hate? Why they smoke on that meth pipe? Hit it like a tweak of town. I'm over here hitting my best life now. Getting my dick sucked by two bitches now. <laughs> I have another baby mama now. At least I ain't got 12 kids that I don't even see now.